of dinosaurs. This will be the greatest theme park in the history of the world. Hello, people, it's Poet, and we're, bur we're back, I can't say it, we're back in Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. We're brack. Um, when we left off, we had made the Spinosaur enclosure, got them all situated. Well, we made the enclosure a long time ago, but we got the Spinosaurus all situated. Since then, I've asked people, like, why, why don't they fight? You know, that's so odd. It turns out that... One of them is a male, and one of them is a female, according to one of the comments that I got. I don't really know how someone would be able to tell. Maybe it says so somewhere? Uh, it doesn't really. It does not really. But I've heard that there are certain mods out there that can make the dinosaurs male and female. So maybe that's what it did. Maybe that's what it did. There's a male and there's a female. And the last time it was male and a male so they always fought. This time it's male and female and they get along. So that's good. Let's see. These guys are all getting along as well. So far I'm not sure if I can have more than two. Kind of like the Spinosaur. One of them always dies. So, I'm thinking maybe you can only have a male and a female, and if there's another male, they're not going to get along? Possibly? I don't know. Such dramatic music. <gasps> what? Oh, 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 that's the other Baryonyx. The one that died, now we replaced it. I was going to say, did it die again? No. It's okay. It's all good. T-Rex is doing fine. Styracosaurs are fine. This... A lot of people, the Carithosaurus and the, uh, what is that, Edmontosaur? What have we got in here? Uranosaur, that's it. They're fine. Iguanodon's fine. Tenontosaurus is fine. Pachycephalosaur, they're fine. Everything's doing okay. Uh oh. Which Red, what's to? this? Oh, research maybe? Uh, Baryonyx remains. Ornithomimus remains. Homocephalae remains. Deinonychus remains. What would you like us to do? Uh, gold, opals. What are your instructions? Sell it. Amber. New research project. All right. Running out of things to research. Dramatic music. There's only these four things to research. So let's get the yes. security sentry turret. Uh, delete that, delete that. All right, let's actually go to the uh, genetics lab. Good to see you. See what we got. Okay. Oh my God, this music. I guess because it's raining. <laughs> Because it's raining, there's like the dramatic raining in Jurassic Park music. Like something bad is going to happen. Nothing bad's happening though. It's all good. Everything's fine. Spinosaur is fine. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything's alright. Everything is A okay. Hmm. How much space do we have? We're running out of space in this area here. I might have to, like... I don't know what I'll do. What about over here? Yeah, I can maybe make a little land bridge. I can make a pathway. Oh, not with that rest area there. I can make a pathway this way and then come around and have dinosaurs over here. What I'll most likely want to do, though, is just get rid of this rest area. Now, people do use this rest area. So I'll have to move it to, like, maybe it can fit right here. Let's see. 
That'd be an amenity. Not a rest room, rest area. Nope, it just it doesn't quite fit there. Maybe I could fit it like right. Hmm. I have an idea. I could fit it right here. But first we gotta get rid of it. Because I want this pathway to come this way so that we can start putting some dinosaurs this way. It's good See on the map? Like if I put the road right here, then I can put some dinosaurs over here. Maybe one over here. And then even have a road that curves around and then put some dinosaurs back here. So that's what I'll do. Yeah. I might lessen the size of the Cacardonosaurus. Uh, enclosure. It is the biggest one. And I don't know that I need it to be the biggest one. I can make it a little bit smaller, but then I, uh, there's not really any reason that it should be smaller. I couldn't fit anything up there anyway. I could fit something right here, too. Right here. Would be a perfect spot for something. Let's do so let's do something. Let's get something going. Uh, what do we got for dinosaurs in this park this today? Is interesting. Satisfied person who cares. <laughs> Ornithomimus. Dalamimus. Velociraptor. Ornithomimus. Spinosaur. Uh Alioramus is looking sick. This is looking very wow. dangerous. Make a call. This guy? Why? Health is poor. Are they attacking each other? I would assume so. But he is getting old too. Let's heal him up. Either way. What? What, 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 what? Returning to base. Baryonyx has killed a visitor. Such poor management not only damages our park's fine reputation, but it also costs engine money. A great deal of money. Wow. So he just ate someone. He probably just ate someone right off of the viewing um, viewing vent. I can't believe that. Can't believe it. I was waiting for that to happen. And that's why... Where is that now? Is it under amenity? No. Is it under dinosaurs? No. Security. Yes. Tombstone. Reminder of why you put so much work into security also for use when security fails. So I put this, apparently, uh, I assume, like this? Do I put it, like, inside the enclosure, or do I put it, like, right here? Okay. I don't really know. I think that's about right. So there we go, a little tombstone. It's kind of weird that it looks so old and dated and stuff. You'd think that it would be like a nice little monument for someone. You've got the Dino into this. Rampage. Let's see what we got here. Rampage, Rampage. It's not the Baryonyx. It's not the Tyrannosaur. It's... Not either of these guys. It can only be the Spinosaurus. Yep. What are you rampaging about? Hmm? Where's the other Spinosaur? Oh, there it is. Rampaging Spinosaurus! Let's try to sedate it. It's rampaging maybe because it didn't have enough water? Which is odd. 
because there's plenty of water in this enclosure, like all over the place. And I think it ran over top of water in its rampage too, so... I don't know, that's weird. That is really weird. So, my rating went down by half a star because of the death. But don't you fret, it will be back up sooner than later. Now, what we were going to do here is figure out what I got for dinosaurs. And I already kind of know. I don't have any Gallimimus and I don't have any Ornithomimus in this park. So, I'm going to assume that that's what I'm going to make right here. And I think that all that they need is low security fence. Um, now let me see here. Welcome How big back. do I want to make it? I want to make it about the size of these two enclosures. So I'll do that. So go from there. There. Uh, to the base. there. All right. Well, is that big enough? Yeah, that's big enough. It's about the same size as these ones, but it's vertical instead of horizontal. So this is nice. This is a nice little enclosure. It's got some water in the corners. A little river in the corner here. Um, build, I'll put in the hatchery. Right here, I guess. Hi there. So we got Gallimimus and Ornithomimus. Oh, that looks so cool. Okay. So I'm going to put... Here's what I'll do. You know what I'll do? I'm actually going to go to the other side here, and I'm going to build another hatchery. Dinosaurs and a hatchery. Flip it around. I'm going to build two. And the reason I'm going to build two, I'll remove them both probably. Great to see but you again. I'm going to make five right. Gallimimus, because they love numbers, I think. And then here I'm going to make five yeah. Ornithomimus. There we go. Now, what I need is a feeder. Herbivore feeder. And, and I'll put in one, two. The rare Asian dinosaur, Gallimimus, is now being exhibited. Please enjoy. Okay, that Gallimimus is looking pretty good. Hey, little Gallimimus. Very cool. But the one I'm really excited about, of course, is Ornithomimus, which looks really nice. As far as models go, it doesn't look that much different than the Gallimimus. Possibly a different neck. And the sound is really weird. That doesn't sound like a Gallimimus to me. No, they sound different. Yeah, we know what they sound like. But these guys... Listen to them! Wow. And yeah, their neck is definitely different. Very cool. And they're very fast! <laughs> I don't know if that guy's glitching out or something. He might have been. He was running very, very, very fast. I think a lot faster than he should have been. Unless they're just naturally faster, but I don't see any others running quite that fast anymore. So we got Gallimimus, Ornithomimus. Let's get some trees in here, of course. Um, now, I don't think that they're going to be eating off the trees, but just in case... I'll put paleo trees in here. Of course, being way more expensive, but, you know, what can you do? So just like that. Just like that. All over the place. Okay, like and we are done. So, bulldoze that. 
and bulldoze that. Now actually I can finish these off with some more paleo trees. That and like that. Very cool. So now they should be pretty happy. Boy, they they sure blend in. Very cool, very cool. Look at these guys. Ornithomimus. Yep. I think that it's really cool. Eh, trees in our way. We're trying to see the dinosaurs here. We're trying to get a nice view of these guys. Very cool. Very, very cool. <sighs> Little things like that I really love. Okay, but what are we going to do to get there? Because this thing's blocking the path, and so is this thing, the cleaner station. There is this path here, but I can't really make it go across this way. You know what? Maybe I don't have to. Maybe... All I have to do is go down, kind of like that, but I already know that I won't be able to put the viewing vents or anything. Hmm, maybe I have to flatten out this area a little bit. There we go. Demolish this. Careful not to demolish, I almost demolished the wall. Um, Okay, and attraction, a viewing platform I'll put right here, because that'll be a good spot. Um, and I'll put a viewing vent. Let's see, viewing dome, viewing vent, right there. And it's a big enough enclosure I think I'm going to put a viewing dome as well. Uh, where is that? There. Let's put it right in the center. Okay. Oops. So now I can go like this. Connect that. Of course I need to put uh, some garbage cans. Well, there's some over there. A lot of places I haven't put them. Like all down here. Near the Spinosaur. Down here. No garbage cans. Okay, there we go. 15 emails. I gotta check that in a second. Um. Okay, there we go. And now maybe a bench. Okay, there we go. So, change the Hi. name of this, maybe? Um, yep, Thrill, looks like. And this dome. Hi there. Terror Dome? 100%. If you say so. If you say so. And this thing. Thrill. Okay. There we go. Yes. All right. Oops. One of the emails just disappeared. This? That was weird. Uh, okay. Delete that. Delete that. Delete what that. What should we do about this? Spinosaurus looking sick. <gasps> what? Why? What's up? What's up, buddy? Territorial, wandering, health is poor. They're not attacking each other. Seems like they're getting along, but... I don't know. How old are you? Age six months, and it can live four years, so... I don't know. Let's, um... Let's revive it. Either way. Tyrannosaur died. You must do something about this. 
Natural causes, yes. Lifespan was two years, and it actually lived for three years. That is incredible. I think that guy lived a very, very healthy life. Had lots of longevity. Let's make a new one. New Tyrannosaur. Uh, <laughs> with no room to put this hatchery. Let me just do what we did with the Baryonyx, maybe. And have, like... Let's just release them to the wild. Right here, maybe. It's good to see you. And, okay, large carnivore. There we go. Now, this one will live 55 years. No problem. That's crazy. I gotta watch it. I gotta watch carefully on this one. Maybe I'll, I'll check I some think emails. I look at this. Grethosaur died. A lot of them is, have died. What should we do? And they've completed research. What should we do about this? Grethosaur died. Yeah, it looks like the Grethosaurus. They're getting old and dying. Hey, little T-Rex guy. Welcome to the world. How are you doing? Is he thinking happy thoughts? <laughs> Is that what that means? Very cool. That's a cool picture, actually. All right, let's not uh, let him get too close to the pathway. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. No, 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 no. Uh, sedate, 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 sedate. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh boy! No, please! You gotta sedate him. Yes. Oh. Wow. That was a close one. Hey guys, you can get up close and personal to the T-Rex. Look at that. Look at this guy. Yeah, now he sees him. Jeez. Okay. Orders. Move. Here we go. <laughs> that was very close. That was very close. I didn't quite realize how close that road was that he could just walk over the river. I don't know why I didn't think about it. Uh, now where's the enclosure for him? Is this it right here? It should be near... No, it should be right... right here, yes. Okay. So drop him down. Crisis averted. T-Rex on the loose. Crisis averted. All right. Very good. Everything okay? Everybody make it home safe. Nobody dead. People who are here. What's this guy doing? Rescue this guy. He's just standing off the path. Anybody else? No, everybody else is fine. It's just Nick. Ran off into the middle of nowhere. So, they rescued him. That's good. It's funny, like, a person could be right here, in the right off the path, and they won't be able to find their way back, and they'd probably die of exposure. It's funny that they do that, but it's what they do. Yeah. These guys aren't charging enough. Should be 14. At least. Now, something else that someone told me is that I'm charging too little at, like, this kiosk or something. I charge five... I charge ten. I only get... Five dollars a piece. I think someone might have read wrong. I'm gonna just double check them all. Someone said that I was losing money at one of them. And I'm pretty sure I'm not, but... Thanks for stopping by. Let's see, I get... Six dollars from that one. I get five dollars from that one. How are you today? I get three bucks from that. I get well, only three three dollars from that one as well. But that's okay. I'm making money in all of them. They said in the second one you're losing money. I think this was the second one that they were talking about. Good to see you again. 
But no, I'm making five five dollars each time. Right? Yeah, five five dollars. I'm not losing five. Is there another kiosk that I made that I'm losing? At thirty dollars and I'm only charging eight? Whoops. Well that might be a problem. There. I'll make two dollars. Maybe that's what they were talking about. Not the kiosk, but the souvenir stands. Good to see you again. Mm. This one, one dollar and I charge six. Okay. Alright. That must have been what they were talking about. Why are they so expensive? Hold on. Good to see you again. Why? The toy? Is the toy the expensive thing? Yeah, it is. But you know what? I don't mind breaking even. I don't mind even losing a little bit of money. Hmm. I don't know. I'll break even. I really don't need to make money on the kiosks and on the souvenir things or anything like that. I mean, I get so much money from the people coming to the park. Like, each time they come, it's $2,000. And I've got 69 people in here at $2,000 each. I mean, I don't need money from kiosks. The only reason I have the kiosks is because they'll otherwise complain that they're hungry. The souvenir stands, nobody's really complaining or needing that at all. What should we do here? I kind of just have that for fun. Uh, amber, amber, alluvial gold. What should we do about this? Uh, okay, so let's see. We went back up to five stars. What Good. would you recommend in this situation? This guy's going to complain that he's not researching anything for days Good if choice. I don't, so let's do that. And actually, let's go to the genetics lab and see what we got here. Great! Spinosaur we already have. There we go. Sell all these things just because. Yes! And that one we can't. We gotta wait a little bit. You can't let this go on. Ilioramus is sick. Uh oh. Revive. Must have been attacked or something. He's stressed out like crazy though, too. I have the feeling that they're they're attacking each other, maybe for territorial reasons. I'm not sure. Anyway, Carithosaurus. So lots of them in here, and they're all dying. Literally, like all of them have died. Hmm. I can't really. Well, maybe I can. I I was gonna say I can't really fit the hatchery in here. I'm not sure if I can. I'll try. Such a big a big building to fit into their enclosure. I really can't do it anywhere. Hmm. If I could almost fit it right here if it wasn't for this dead body. Can I move it? I can't do anything with it. So I'm actually going to have to wait. Because I need to put the hatchery like right here. And that dead Carithosaurus is in the way. Well now there's more than... There's the Aranosaur in the way now. But yeah, just that one guy. <gasps> wait, I can fit him. Aha! That actually flattened a bit of the mountain. That's How okay. Can I, help? I don't mind that. Okay, Crethosaur is a large. I'm gonna say yes. Okay. Okay. So I gotta remember to take that out of the enclosure when I'm done. Are you gonna let this go? That's okay, right? Yeah. 
This is way out of my league. What's your advice? Absolutely. Okay, extract, extract, extract. This is a complete disaster. Will you do something now? Yeah, he looks like a complete disaster. Whoa! Right before our eyes. What happened to you, little guy? Okay. What's he craving? What's he need? Water. And hunting ability, maybe? Returning to base. Are there not enough modern trees in here? I can I can't put any more. I honestly can't put any more. But he was revived and now he's he's fine, so I don't know. Sometimes the dinosaurs in this are Great to see you again. A little bit fickle, a little bit odd. A little bit strange. How can I help? Yeah, okay. Man, alright. Well, in today's episode, we got these Ornithomimus. Can't see them. Can't see them. That one just laid down and... Man, their sound is still really weird. Weird to get used to. Not weird in a bad way. Oop! Looking at the wrong thing. Okay. There we go. Now we can kind of see them all from afar. So we got Ornithomimus. We accidentally released a T-Rex on the public, which thankfully we were able to quickly get rid of that problem. Now this T-Rex is safe and sound in his enclosure. We had a Spinosaurus go on the rampage and several Alioramus. Uh oh. We got a sick... Sick little dinosaur here. What are you sick with? Let's immunize you with something. The entire species. Right. There we go. It's got a sore tummy. Apparently. I'll have to watch that because that'll spread. Yep. Here we go. All the older dinosaurs. There we go. Uh oh. And right over here too. This is what we do. Ah, oh, little Styracosaur sneeze. It sounded kind of cute and adorable. And there we go. All the older dinosaurs are sick, but the ones that have been born after immunizing Return happens the in the hatchery are fine. There we go. And with that quelling of the sickness... I'm gonna say you're loud. I'm gonna say goodbye. Like this video. Comment below and do all those other awesome things you people do. We'll see you next time in Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. Bye bye.